my hair is messy okay, so good afternoon and welcome again to my channel so for the past couple of days i was working on a day shift and for this week i will be working as a night nurse oh, no. um, so i just thought that maybe I can walk you through on how do I prepare myself for the night and hopefully you will enjoy it and also I will give you tips or advice on how to make your night more productive when you work so just you know um, here at Dublin if you work as a nurse it's normally a 12-hour shift so the timing when you work at night is from 8 p.m. to 8 a.m. the next day so it's gonna be a long 12 hour shift Aww. one important preparation that you can do if you work on a night shift is proper sleep or not sleep so like me I was asleep from 12 noon until 6 p.m. so 6 hours sleep is not too bad at all Wow. Just for a side note, if there's one thing that I learned from being an OFW, um, that is to be independent Aww. because of the mere fact that you have no mama, you have no papa who's going to, to look after you, so you have to uh, mind yourself all the time um, from cooking, um, ironing your clothes, groceries. I have to do it on my own. So. Yeah, it's, I think that's just the way it is. So another thing that I can advise um, is mind setting or mind conditioning. I usually do this one just to make myself ready and what to expect and what will be the routine like because sometimes um, working, working on a day shift is a bit different if you're working at night. This is my headphone. So when I'm traveling, I can listen to music. And this is my active watch. It's kind of good because it's monitoring how many steps I did the whole shift. And it's also measuring my heart rate, stress level. So yeah, it's a good company. This is my leap card. Um, I use this one for traveling in the bus so I don't have to pay cash. I will just tap this one and we're good to go. My phone. Okay, so I'm all set. I'll be heading my way now to the hospital. The traveling time will be around 30 minutes. So yeah, I'll see you later. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my So I'm in the world now and it's time to get change. When I'm out, so try not to hold me down, feel when I'm in this. Um, the shift was okay. Um, we were kind of busy on the first three or four hours of the shift, but now we're kind of like settled a little bit. Uh, by the way, I'm working with my um, senior nurse tonight and yeah, she just, she just want to say hi. <laughs> Hi there! Shout out to my son, Carlo Cabral. Hello there! It's amazing. Um, I'm working with two Filipinos as well tonight. So it's like an all Filipino team. Yeah, that makes the work easier because communication wise, it's not easy. I know it's not that difficult because you share the same language. Proud Filipinos. I'm just back from work and it was a busy night but it, it wasn't too bad at the end anyway another advice I can give if you work as a night nurse would be like coffee well for me I had two cups of coffee last night so it kind of pulled me up a little bit and I wasn't drowsy the whole time so yeah for me it works but if you like coffee go for it 
Also, I, I don't know, but for me, when I'm on my break, I tend to listen to music and the kind of music that I, lis uh, that I listen are quite the one with the fast beat. So it's kind of like pump, pump me up a little bit, keep me awake all night. So that's it, guys. Um, thank you for watching. I have to go to sleep now because I have five more nights left. Oh, but that's just the way it is. And then again, um, if you're not subscribed yet to my channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button. Give this video a like and then click the, the notification bell so that if I will upload more videos, you will be the one the first to see it. Thank you so much. God bless. Keep safe, guys. We are now moving from ECQ to GCQ, so changes will be done. But anyway, protect yourself at all times. God bless. Signing off.